Yeah, I think we should, and we've gotten a good start at that, but let me uh, tell you that one of the exciting things is the growth in that sector and looking at, and this is true all over the state, looking at you know, a company on the North Shore uh, that makes devices. What I love is that the, the people in the company are all engaged not only in the business and the creativity of where they're going, they have pictures of all the people they've helped on their walls, the people who, because they didn't have to have a heart transplant, have been able to uh, survive. And that really makes the connection with employees and their business and the people they're working with. Um, uh, for instance, out in Lee, where I was born and then moved to North Adams when I was one, there are, uh, there's a company that's looking at taking uh, two of the old mill buildings there, one for manufacturing, but the other to provide housing for those workers. So what we can do is we connect those dots and say precision manufacturing, computer science, investing in our kids in the Vogue Tech Schools. One young man at Lynn Vocational Tech School never thought he would go to college. He's got a four-year electrical engineering scholarship to go to Bucknell because of the work we're doing here in schools. We can increase that and give those kids that opportunity and then work with you on precision manufacturing. And it was that company that moved south they were a manufacturing company. They said, we thought we could get better um, energy costs, frankly, in the South. I can't do much about Mother Nature, but we're doing our best to lower energy costs here. But they said, we came back to Massachusetts because we need people with a good eighth grade education. And I think that's telling about our investment uh, on the government side in the education workforce piece, particularly working with you as to what we need. We've got a great f future for precision manufacturing and, and other kinds of uh, growth out of what is happening right now uh, in Massachusetts. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah.